All right, here's my introduction to my reef room, or my uh, tank room, I guess. We uh, got three 250 metal, metal highlights up there, uh, 14K. Just put those in today. Things are looking quite a bit bluer than they did yesterday. Things are a little bit stirred up right now, um, so the tank's a little bit cloudy, but it looks pretty good. Anyhow, um, got a reef controller coming in the next week or two. Haven't decided whether to go with a reef keeper or with a apex controller. So far, the only reactor I have going is this is this GFO reactor. I may set up a carbon reactor. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do carbon reactor or just keep keep it in the socks. Um, and I haven't figured out, so far I've just been slowly dosing with uh, calcium and or with Kalkwasser because I, uh, I don't have a whole bunch of a load yet or I don't use up a whole bunch of Kalkwasser yet or calcium. Anyway, things are pretty stable. They hold pretty high. Um, probably will go, I'm not sure if I'm going to dose or if I'm going to go with a calc reactor or whatever. Anyway, so here's the sump. I'm going to have to go to the other side and get out of the light. i got a light shining in here because there's usually not light down here. <clears throat> there's a the skimmer, which is full. The last couple days has been filling up in about 12 hours. I'm just dry it out a little bit. And then here's my homemade sock holder works great. I plumb this as my overflow. Anyhow. So this first section here, I actually am going to do something with it, I'm not sure. Probably get some rock in there and maybe uh, put in a mana shrimp or something. A buddy of mine's got a couple of them and I think they're beautiful and my problem is, is I'd like to have it in more of a display tank than just hiding down underneath my display tank. Anyhow, I run 10,000 K lights here. My plan is to get some frags in here. I've had a few frags on this rack, which sits above my refugium. There's my refugium. What I have is I got a pump in the middle of my refugium here. Uh, the purpose of that pump is to keep the system going when I have my mixing area emptied out and mixing uh, salt which is this section over here above it right now I have a whole bunch of rock in there just getting ready to uh, put frags on and I'll probably hide them over here on top of the refugium soon enough this is my overflow area or my uh, top off and uh, mixing area I got a pump in here and that will be hard hard plumb so that I can uh, keep the pump going and just use it as mi a mixer and then when time comes turn off the mixer and have it pump up into the tank again. So what happens is everything flows from left to right. Um, eventually that valve down there, sorry for the mess, eventually that valve down there will be um, plumbed into the uh, drain so it will be a matter of pulling the 20, about 25, 24, 25 gallons out of here. Uh, probably be less actually because of how high it is. Um, I'll just be able to drain it, dump the salt in, let it fill up and mix. All done. Okay. There's my ballast. I need to turn them on end so a little more air goes through them. I had a fan over here which was keeping them nice and cool. Now they're a little bit warmer. Actually, they're not too warm right now. Lights have been running for probably 20 minutes. And, uh, and that's my light controller, which I don't have set up quite how I want to yet. Um, I might get one more. That way I can run a few different things off of it. It's a great timer. I really like it. And then there's my lights. i got vents up top. Eventually doors will be up there and I'll have to 
shim them out so enough air gets around them. I'll have four doors where I'll be able to access from the front. And then on the bottom I'll have four doors as well. And then here's the tank from the back side, kind of boring. Got the overflows figured out. Bio pellets. I've been holding zero nitrates now for about a month. About three months in. Not even three months in. Well, about three months in. And, uh, and that's all I have besides the rock and deep sand bed to keep the nitrates down. And uh, they're virtually zero as far as I can tell. Anyway, well, there you go.